A week after Melissa Mooney stopped answering her phone, cops made a grim discovery when they went to her L.A. apartment and opened the refrigerator. Five months later, a man is facing murder charges. It wasn't like Melissa Mooney not to answer her phone. When a week went by, we just knew something was off. Her cousin Bailey Babb told Los Angeles's KTLA. Her messages weren't delivering and we knew something was up because we all have a special relationship with Melissa. On September 12th, responding to her mother's request for a welfare check, LAPD officers made a grisly discovery at Mooney's downtown LA apartment building. The 31-year-old was dead, her body wedged inside her own refrigerator, according to an investigative summary report obtained by E! News. Detailing the findings from a September 17th autopsy, the report noted there was blunt force trauma to Mooney's head, face, back and upper left arm, as well as ligature marks around her wrists and ankles where she'd been tied up with white charging cables, shoelaces and articles of clothing. While the autopsy didn't uncover a clear mechanism of death, the medical examiner concluded in the report that Mooney's death was caused by homicidal violence inflicted by others. Authorities now believe they have the man who inflicted the homicidal violence in custody. The Los Angeles District Attorney's Office has charged Magnus Daniel Humphrey with felony murder and torture, according to L.A. Supreme Court records reviewed by ACA News. Humphrey, 41, was arrested at his home in Minnesota on an unrelated federal warrant while on probation for federal narcotics offenses, according to the LAPD, and has waived extradition, paving the way for him to be transported to L.A. to face charges. Authorities have not yet shared any more details about what brought them to Humphrey, but here's a look at the investigation into Melissa Mooney's murder so far.